Ramsey from their off stump channel. That's a lovely piece of off spin bowling, and well, he can't believe it. Oli Pop, but he got a good one. And what pitches don't always allow you to do. And that has gone a long way. That is whatever that's found, whatever piece of turf that's found, make a note. It was very full. So there is an argument that Oli Pope could have done something to at least defend that. If he's getting the reaction for the surface, he has to stay there. He'll be effective. He'll pose few problems for the batters. He's rejected. Perfect line, perfect length, a bit of drop. And it challenges the inside edge and the outside edge. Classic off-spin bowling to a right-hander on a pitch that's offering now a bit of turn. Oh, got him. Root looking to sweep has dragged it on and Sajid has a wicket here. It's a big one. There was a bit of an angle here to the bat. Just gets the bottom edge, the bottom edge drags it back on. So that frustration for Saji Khan is just eased a little bit. It's a big scalp for him. Root goes to 34. England three down for 211. Yeah, a rare, a rare error of judgment. That ball was quite full to have employed that stroke. Managed an inside edge onto the stumps. But at this moment, the off spinner will cherish. Got a big, big wicket, big scalp. Ben Duckett looking like he's enjoying himself, and why wouldn't you? He has a fourth Test match hundred, his second here in Pakistan. And done now. It's another wicket for Sajid, who's bringing Pakistan back into the game with two big wickets late in the day for Pakistan. First of all, Root, and now Duckett caught at slip. Remove both the danger man. That was an ideal delivery. Having the batsman driving through extra cover, only managed an edge. And for a change in the slips. Salmani Liaga stayed still and held it quite easily. But excellent knock from Ben Duckett, 114. From 129, he dominated the proceeding. It's 2.24 for four. Yeah! Oh, Baldin, beauty! Sahaj is on one here. Big wickets have fallen to him. Root first of all, then Duckett, and now Harry Brook. Every time he has looked to ball outside the off stump, not the right option taken by Harry Brook. Was a danger missing the ball when it's turning back into the stumps. But he has prevailed in this spell thrice. The off spinner Sajid Khan, and it's the danger man, Harry Brook. Being dismissed for just nine. 225 for five. Shown in the past, notably at Hyderabad last winter. Catch it! Cast goes down the ground, but he's going to pick out Saud Shaquille here at mid-on, who, unlike in the first Test match, when he dropped a dolly there, has taken it comfortably, and it is a five-wicket haul for Sajid Khan. The first off-spinner to do so in Pakistan, the first Pakistan off-spinner to do so here since Saklain Mushtaq 24 years ago. Well, this is a mighty good breakthrough for Pakistan. The pressure was being built and well, he wanted to be aggressive, but not the right shot to play. Played it down the throat of the man at long on, who held on to it. South Shaquille takes a very good catch. They needed this breakthrough Pakistan and it has happened in the first 20 minutes of day three. Could only get four, 248 for seven. Oh, beauty! Sajid Khan has six and Matthew Potts looking to play back is completely befuddled and bemused as the ball spins between his legs and onto the stumps. Well, he's trying to cover the off-stub angle. 
maybe it was on middle and off stump stance as well but got ball around his legs what a beauty it is really to target the stumps on a spinning track is so difficult through his legs in fact through his legs yes. opening up to maybe place that ball into the gap away towards square leg not to be Sajid Khan is red hot his sixth and Potts goes after scoring just six to 56 for eight Oh, 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 big sweep, but straight to Shan Masood. Shan Masood gets the catch. Sajid gets his seventh. England bowled out for 291. They trail by 75. And this has been the tenth time when Pakistani spinners have claimed all ten wickets at home in innings. Sajid Khan, seven for 111. Yeah, brilliant for him and for Pakistan. Real character, real skill. Wears his heart on his sleeve, but more importantly, delivers when it counted here. When it started to spin, he has been wonderful. And that is a real top performance from Sajid Khan. He has loved every minute of it and appreciated by his teammates. Oh, that's gone up in the air. This should be the first one for Pakistan. Rizwan catches the ball. Duckett has been removed from the seed. It's Sajid who strikes again. In combination with Salman Ali Aga, and now a key wicket with the new ball. Duckett going for that favoured sweep shot that has served him so well in Pakistan. But not this time. The new ball, bit of extra bounce, and the celebration that we've seen so often in this game. Yeah, for Duckett this time, he was stressing a bit. He hadn't quite got that one right, just to say the least. So, couldn't get on top of it, couldn't get full bat on it. Keeper, of course, with the gloves, always the... Man. Oh, yes. This has become legend already. Good! Have a look at that. It's as simple as you like, and guess who? Sajid Ali with the ball. Just tries to go there. And the inside edge comes into play. And we have seen that celebration so many times. An early wicket for Pakistan. Pope goes for 22. 37 for 3. This really wasn't on this drive outside to the line outside that off stump in an easy catch. So he was bowling for a cotton bowl or a bowled out and he got a great result in the end. Jabby jerky movement from Pope. Now, has that hit the pad? Has it hit the pad? Given it has. Pope will ask, did I get outside the line? He's going to have a look. Okay, flat line as the ball passed the bat. You can go to ball tracking. No bat in all, Chris. Ball tracking. Original decision given out. Pitching outside dog, impacting line, wicket sitting. Chris, you can stay with your original decision out. You're on the screen, make your signal. Ah! Oh, now, that's incredibly close, surely. Yeah, Root is virtually walking. He doesn't wait for the umpire's decision. He went back, it stayed low. Root has gone, big wicket. He inwiggled the batsman, forced him. To the back foot and a bit of turn doing the job. This is a big wicket. Big scalp for the off spinner Sajid Khan. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Ball around the legs. Tries the sweep shot, gets too far across. Pakistan have another. Hitting the leg pick. And his ability to spin the ball from within the stumps. He starts a little wider outside the off stump, but that was more on that off stump line. And Brook was never in. Pakistan are having a great first session. England have won the toss, but everything else has belonged to Pakistan. Five down, Brook goes after scoring only five, 98 for five. Yeah, Brook there attempting a sweep shot. Got in front of the stumps. Quicker was Sajid in fake. Gone. Brilliant. 
absolutely brilliant in the slip from Salman Ali Aga. And guess who is Sajid with the ball he has for? Lovely length, so he's trying to drive in. There's enough turn. That's a great catch from Salman Ali Aga. He's very close at first slip, diving away. Sajid Khan, we've seen that celebration last couple of weeks and it's carrying on. England now lose their captain for 12, it's 118 for 6. And if you're going to drive, you want to be to the pitch of the ball. Stokes is looking to drive. Yeah, he's very close to Salman Eliaga, so that's gone sharply towards him. Get to the pitch, use your feet. And gone. Not to use your feet. And five wicket haul for Sajid. It's no mean achievement. The guy is unstoppable. Incredible comeback for Sajid and also for Norman Ali. And what a comeback it has been. Third five wicket haul. And clean him up with a lot of deception. Rehan could only get nine. England. Well, this innings is nearing an end now. 2.58 for nine. Heinous mistake here. He should have known, I, in my book, he should have known he was nowhere near that. Stop the shot, smother it, get a pad, a bat, anything you like in the way, make sure it doesn't get past. Pakistan have no reviews mainly, uh, sorry, reviews remaining. And they don't need them. That is the simplest of stumpings for Rizwan. So Sajid doesn't get his man the ball before, but he does get his man at the end just to wrap things up. First thing this morning, having opted to bat first, would have had high ambitions of a proper total. Is this a proper total? Well, only time will tell, 267. But Jack Leach there also getting nowhere near the ball. Nowhere near it at all. So the familiar celebration from Sajid Khan signals his sixth wicket and the end of the England innings for 267 and he can walk off proudly displaying yet another cricket ball to add to his collection. Ah! That's a very, very close call. Sajid Khan's pleading all of the fielders from Pakistan. He's saying that's gone. Skipper, let's have a look. to go to the ultra edge looks like small gap there would like to go to the ultra edge okay flat line as the ball past the bat we can go to ball tracking when it's ready original decision is not out pitch outside of impact in line wicket sitting cycled you need to change your decision. A fantastic, fantastic review. He was certain, he was 100% sure. Make a signal. Confirmation now on screen. Pakistan draw first blood. But once there was no inside edge, it was only a matter of height. Ben Duckett is not a tall man. And that's hitting, not the bales. Oh, oh, beautifully ball, flighted up the quicker ball. Then the slow one, tempting. And Smith, who played so well in the first innings, has to go. England still behind, six down. Outstanding bowling from these two. Noman, first of all, and now Sajid Khan. Seeing Jamie Smith coming, he signalled his intentions early on then, so he held it back, gave it a little bit more air, held it back so that Smith was nowhere near the pitch of the ball. Beautiful piece of bowling. See as the ball there goes up out of the hand. Lovely bowling. Say what you like about the shot, but it's a beautiful bit of bowling. The control to hold that one back. A to see the batter coming, to know that he's coming down the pitch and looking to be aggressive, and then to react as he did. Brilliant. I thought you summed him up perfectly yesterday, Ath, when you said he, he has got a lot of passion. But he doesn't let that get in the way of being smart. He did that with the bat yesterday. Towards the back end. Oh, yeah. Got him. Sajid with another. Just goes through the defences yet again. England lose their eighth. And keeps picking up wickets. A bit of loop, a bit of turn. Gate between bat and pad. And that was more than enough. For Sajid Khan to strike again. 
and is nigh in this test match for England. How about that delivery? Yeah, quicker, flatter. Did him for land, did him for pace. Also, all turning back into the stumps. Yeah. Bring something, something. Oh, yeah. 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 Ten wickets in the game once again for the off spinner Sajid Khan. What an effort! What an impression he has made in this Test match series, Sajid Khan. First spinner to take a 10 wicket haul in Rahul Pindi. And the celebrations and thank you to the heavens, but it's been absolutely brilliant. The off spinner has been turning the ball and challenging every England batter. That little sweep done with the turn and hit leg stump. A steely character plays with his heart on his sleeve. And once again, you see a leap into the air. It's been fantastic. It's been the shirt which was full of blood when that, that gash was leaking, oozing blood.